Hi everybody, it's Holly from Hollywood Beauty on Instagram. If you haven't checked me out already, make sure to check me out over there. I post every single day about makeup, beauty, and style. And don't forget to subscribe to me here on YouTube. I post every week with brand new beauty style videos for you babes. So today's video is a review on some new NARS Cosmetics products. So they launched the new Weightless Foundation, which I also have a review on, but they also launched these new Afterglow products. And it's beyond beautiful. We have the Afterglow cheek palette, which I'm gonna be going through, and then they also launched some Afterglow lip glosses that are just beyond stunning, and I feel like lip glosses are just like the best thing right now, and these shades are just beyond, so I will be swatching them and telling you how I like them so far. So I'll start with the palette because it's just beautiful. NARS palettes are, the quality is amazing. You get such good value in these palettes because you get so many powders and all of these like NARS powders, just such amazing quality. It's great. So this is kind of meant to be blush and highlight, hence the cheek palette situation. So I will swatch these for you and kind of like give you the rundown. The first shade here is Breathless. So this is like a rose gold shimmery highlight. It is absolutely stunning and kind of glides onto your cheekbones and blends into your cheek, whatever blush you're wearing, just beautifully. I wore this yesterday and on my face and it was just beyond stunning. The next shade is Devotion, which is right here. It's kind of a very light mauve kind of color, like pinky, light pink mauve, I would call it. This is Devotion here. It is a matte warm pink. So this is kind of a blush on the lighter side, but it is obviously buildable as I just did on my arm and that would look so beautiful just as a nice light blush on the cheeks. And then we have Savage right down here. Presentation is so, so good. So I feel like this shade would be good to use. Like you could, I would use it like as a contour blush type situation, but it's just got that mix of shimmer and creaminess that is just will be so gorgeous and blendable and then we have exhibit a look at this shade this one's gonna be really fun I feel like this would be really fun to play with just adding a little pop like a little light dust it off and just lightly apply that to the cheeks and it would just be really fun on darker skin tones this would look amazing too so so gorgeous and then this shade right here this kind of pinky shade is Liberté, which is a burnished apricot. So that's a really, really gorgeous kind of pinky, pinky peach shade that I think everybody just loves in blushes. It looks good on so many skin tones and would be really wearable. And the last shade in the cheek palette is Flirt, which is this color right here. Kind of a plummy shade to me. So that is gorgeous. That looks so good on like my mom, these kind of shades look so good on her skin tone. Obviously you don't know what that is, but it's a really, really gorgeous kind of berry color. And this is really complimentary on a lot of skin tones and it looks amazing in the winter. I love this kind of shade with winter makeup. That is the blushes. I'm gonna move on to the lips now. So for these lips, I think in total there was, looks like 10, looks like 10 shades. They're really gorgeous, like shimmery shades. I have six of them to show you. A couple of them are just my absolute favorites. So this Afterglow Lip Shine is just supposed to be like a mirror luster on your lips, and they definitely are. A comfortable, cushiony gloss, and it's kind of supposed to go with the cheek palette as a glowy kind of combo. Start with my favorites, because they're out of the package. I've already been using them. Um, these two shades, oh my goodness. Look how stunning. They are. So the pink shade, I was so drawn to. This is called Lover to Lover. So I'm just gonna put it on my lips too because look how glassy and gorgeous that looks. And this kind of is like an amazing topper. Like it good, looks good on like everything. So this is Lover to Lover. And then the next shade, which I've already opened to because it looked beyond gorgeous, is so this is a luster right next to it. And the next shade is Super Vixen. This is a gorgeous like lip color shade. You can wear this on your own with nothing else. 
and this is a shimmering rose bronze color. So kind of a deeper pinky nude. And that is Super Vixen. And we have Chelsea Girls, which I feel like I know this name. It's like a popular lip color with NARS. This is a warm beige pink. Look how gorgeous and pigmented that is. It would look gorgeous on itself or just a little color and sheerness. Kind of put on top of a lipstick too. It would be really high impact color and a nice little gloss to it. And then the last one I have is called Aragon. This is a red chestnut and this is another kind of lipstick one. It doesn't have shimmer in it or it's just a kind of single tone gloss. Stunning. Like I've been loving that kind of ready brown lip color. It just brings out your features so much and like makes your eyes pop I feel like and you don't have to wear tons of makeup. And it's just really nice to wear this with like brows, lashes, maybe a little blush. And it's just a stunning natural look. I really love this shade, Aragon. But that is my little review of the new NARS Afterglow collection. It's stunning, as you can tell. Let me know if you guys pick up anything from this line. And as always, don't forget to check me out on Instagram at Hollywood Beauty. I post every single day over there. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to me on YouTube. I post every week for you babes. So I hope you have a wonderful week and I'll see you next time.